Oh, oh, oh. oh. Stephen Nathan has the best hair in show business, and it's uh, it's, it's real. So some, but sometimes I say it isn't because look at that. How can anyone... I actually did a show <laughs> where two people bet one guy one guy bet someone ten thousand dollars that I was wearing a rug. <laughs> now two things: he lost the bet, and two. It's horrible. It's real hair and it looks fake. There's no upside to having the hair. Oh no, that's fabulous hair. That's great hair, my friend. I don't know. But it is real. It is, it's real. Even though I will continue to tweet from time to time that it's fake, just to amuse myself. Well, I said it was a dog. <laughs> the baby is in me, Booth. I'm more financially secure than you. Objectively, I'm more rational. This should be my decision. You know, it, it, things change as they do in life, but Brennan and Booth are still the same people they always have been. So they're dealing with this new um, event in their own distinctly unique ways. So the show doesn't change, it merely evolves. You know, they're not different people, totally different people. Brennan learns more about herself, has other people in her life. Um, and Booth has decided to take the plunge with someone even though they're not married, something he's never done before. And, um, you know, but the show still chugs along. We have babies, but it's still a murder show. You know? They have another area to disagree about everything in. You know, they disagree about how to solve crimes. They disagree on the way the world is, the way the universe is constructed. They also disagree on how to raise a child. but in the way they disagree, which is inc with incredible love and support for each other, but it's funny, and it gives us a chance to comment on it. And, you know, uh, as, as you've said before, the character that changes the most is Brennan, who all of a sudden has two people in her life that her happiness is contingent upon. She, her happiness is, is attached to a baby and to a man, and she's never had that before. So it's, it's a shocking change for her, and amusing for Booth. Where's the rest of me? Well, I assume he's referring to the rest of the remains because Lincoln seems intact. Do we have a time of death yet, Dr. Hodgins? Well, according to the uh, blowfly eggs in the orbital sockets, we're looking at about two days. We have Sorry. a writer's room up, upstairs from our office. Above us, in fact, is, a, is the writer's room. And those writers are in there chunking out murders these and amazing and, stories and, yeah. and these amazing stories the plots and the science our science is quite accurate and um, they're you know a shout out to the writers they then they tell us they pitch them to us and we reject some and and say no try again or uh, well, we yes work we like with this. them and you know but they give us gold you know we're just um, we're just thrilled you know this the stories have always been terrific 